Okay, I am back. Sorry, everyone. I'm not sure what happened. Okay, are you guys there? Hello. <clears throat> I see seven people here. Say hi so that I know you're here. Okay, all good. Okay. Yeah, I had to go and restart my my video, like my webcam and all that. So, sorry. That was really crazy. I don't do this live thing a lot. <laughs> I should probably should start doing this more often so that I get better at it. <clears throat> all good. Okay, awesome. <clears throat> so sorry. Okay, so this is the sketch that we are going to be using today. I'm just going to put this in front of me so I remember what it looks like. And we are going to be using these two photos as the one four by six photo. So the first thing that I want to do, hello, is that Arnona? <clears throat> and let's see, Ruthann, hello, hi, welcome. Okay, so I'm kind of thinking I'm not really sure. I think I want to mat these two on a black, just a black cardstock. So I'm going to grab some black from my stash. <clears throat> This did not come in my kit, just so you guys know. I'm just going to, I think I'm going to mat them individually. Well, I think I kind of maybe want to see the nurse's face. I don't know. What do you guys think? Should I mat them like three by four? Or should I map them right next to each other? What do you think? Hello, Tiffany. Hello, how are you? And Samira, let's see, who else do I see? That's all I see, okay. I think I said hello to everyone. Oh, Kyle, hello, how are you? And Heidi. Okay, so anyone want to choose how I lay out my photos? I'm not really sure I care to see the nurse and so I was thinking if I do three by fours I could overlap one of them I just want to see the nurse's hands what do you ladies and men think <laughs> I guess there's more than ladies here separately okay you mount your picks separately okay okay so separately that's what we're going to do. So just like this, do you guys like that? Should I do one four by six separately, do you think? Okay, I'm just going to start gluing stuff down. Again, I'm only going to do like just a, a little bit of glue on this one because I think I'm going to print it off as a, a black and white photo. Okay, so there we go. So have you guys um, been doing anything fun? Lots of scrapbooking, anything? Tell me what you guys have been up to. I've been getting better and better each day. My health issues are getting better. I just actually went and saw my doctor and he says I look great and I'm doing great. And so I'm super excited about that. Okay, so this one I think we'll set aside. I do like this pink. It really makes the photos pop. So maybe we'll have the pink be one of the layers behind the photo. I think I like that idea. Okay. Does, so we are doing spring break next week. Like my kids don't have school next week. Is anybody else on spring break 
this week or next week. I'm super jealous of my children that they get to actually just sit at home and do nothing. Because I would really, really love to just do nothing. Okay, so I think I'm going to move this over here. Okay, I need to like move everything out of the way. I have way too much stuff on my desk. Okay. Spring break is this week. Oh, fun. Okay. Are you doing anything fun this week or just taking it easy? Staycation? What are you doing? Okay, Nancy, you're a retired teacher, so you're on permanent spring break. How nice. Okay, what do you guys think about these two pink backgrounds? So I like the, the hearts, but then I don't like it against this pink. So maybe if I use the hearts as a background, I could do like the green kind of as this bigger mat. What do you think about that? Doing projects around the house. Oh, those are always needed to be being done, huh? And scrapbooking, Arnona, that's awesome. I wish I could be scrapbooking all next week, but I am actually going to be having surgery at the end of May again, and I'll get like two months off of work. So that'll be my scrapbook vacation. <laughs> okay, so I'm thinking I do really like this. You like the green between the two pinks. Okay. Well, and I'm kind of wondering, I kind of like the idea of cutting this and having this be a mat for this whole thing here. What do you guys feel about that? I'm not sure. I'm just, I think I'm just going to cut it and we're just going to see how it looks. And if I don't like it, then I won't do it. So let's glue this down to the pink and then we'll glue this tentatively down to the green and we'll just kind of see if we like it or not. The comments keep disappearing. I don't know what is happening with Facebook. Okay, so let's cut this down and I think actually on the one side, I think I want to do a let's see I think I'm gonna do like a, a ripped border that wasn't as pretty as I liked or thought it would be I didn't want to rip very well there we go okay I like that better okay what do you think about that? Okay. I like that. And then I could do, let's see, maybe we'll do the green piece down here at the bottom, but then I'll go like this and we'll kind of do, let's see. Now I need to make like a little journaling piece right here. So I think I'm gonna do kind of something a little bit different where my background paper or my mat paper mat is off to the left and then my journaling piece will be to the right more. Okay, so that's my idea. That's what I'm going with. Okay, so I'm gonna start taking off the border strips. So have you guys gotten your kits yet? I know they've been kind of coming a little bit late and we apologize about that. It's so frustrating 
like the working with companies these days and the products and they don't get to us as fast as we had hoped and you know all this stuff um so yeah we're really really sorry about that and hopefully you guys can be patient with us and understand oh excuse me understanding i know how frustrating it is to have to wait all month long for a kit and we are so sorry about that okay so let's see what i want to do so this paper actually might be perfect because I could add like journaling lines on this part. So I am really stretching this kit to work for me. <laughs> do you guys do that a lot sometimes? Like make a kit work in different ways that it's really generally not meant to work? <laughs> Got my kit last week. Yay, Ruthann, I'm so glad. I, it, I always feel so bad like when I look in the group and people are like, oh, I didn't get my kit. And I'm just like, oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. I hate that. Okay, so I think what I will do, maybe what I'll do is I will cut out this heart. That was definitely not straight at all. <laughs> I kind of like this heart and I kind of, I want to do something with it, but I don't know what. Has anybody started scrapbooking with their kit if they've gotten it? Um, when I got my kit, I immediately sat down and made two layouts. And I'm awful. I was supposed to post my layout. Oh, my. Achoo! Oh, excuse me. Sorry. I was supposed to post. Wow, that's kind of weird to say together. Supposed to post my layout on Instagram last week. And I totally spaced it. So. I am just failing this week, you guys. I think actually it was supposed to be this week. I can't remember. Yeah, that's that's just how my life is right now. So wouldn't that be super cool to do something with? Oh, you know what would be really cool is doing like some hand stitching or even just doing some machine stitching and like making it look like it was all stitched together. <gasps> that would be so cool. Okay. I'm, I'm totally going to have to make a layout with that now. I tore right into my kit. I'm working on my third layout. I love the colors of these papers. Me too. They just go so well together and they're so happy, aren't they? <coughs> Sorry. Apparently I have the sneezes. Okay, now I think what I'm going to do, maybe, ooh, <gasps> You know what? I'm totally going to do that. Oh my gosh, that totally just like worked out so organically. Okay, and I'm going to tear this so it looks kind of more cohesive. Oh my goodness, I absolutely love that. Okay, and then I'll start doing my journaling here and I can add an embellishment here, kind of like the sketch. So the sketch has an embellishment up here. That's totally perfect. And you know what? <laughs> this kit has a little, a cute little, um, I was just going to say umbrella. What is this called? Hot air balloon. It has two of them actually. So that would totally go. I think I'm going to use the yellow one. Oh my goodness. This is totally just falling into place. This is my third layout. Um, I do need to get on and post my other layouts. I think I do like it with the full background. So I think I'm going to keep that. So now I just need to glue the rest of this photo mat down. And I'm sorry, I have the sniffles. It is definitely springtime. Okay. I'm going to Mount Rushmore, Black Hills, over spring break, and can't wait to scrap my photos with this kit. Oh, that'll be perfect. Yes, I agree. The, these papers will definitely be perfect. That is so exciting. So do you live by Mount Rushmore, 
Or is it a ways away from you? Okay, so I think I'm gonna place that there. Okay, now for the journaling piece. I actually have this too. That would be kind of cool to use that as another layer on here. Let's see if that will work. I'll cut it out and see if I like it. If I don't like it, then I won't use it. It might be a lot of pink without any separation. So let's see if we like it. Utah, that's a 10 hour drive. Oh, wow. Well, that's awesome that you are going to do that for spring break. I wish I had thought more about spring break. I always just, I don't know, like we don't always do things for spring break. So like once it comes around, it's just like, oh yeah, spring break, <laughs> you know, like I totally forgot. Okay, so if I'm going to, let's see, if I'm going to add this, I think I would want it to be down here. Do you guys like that? And then I can do my journaling here, or should I just put this maybe here and then do my journaling all around it? I'm not really sure how much journaling I need to do. Um, it is kind of a big story, Brennan getting ready to go to middle school. Um, this is my middle son. He's 15 now, which is insane. He's in high school. I'm kind of thinking I like this better. What do you think? So I could do this yellow one or I could do this one. And this actually might go better because it's got the flowers, the flowers, the green, the green, the pink, the pink, and then the off-white, the off-white. Any voters out there? Yeah, I think I like this better. Okay, so we're going to go, we're going to do that one. And then, let's see, okay. I think I do like this. Um, I'm trying to think if I want to do, like what I want to do for my title this is a lot about girls and obviously my son is not a girl um I wonder I could probably do this but again I don't want to start layering on top of this photo because I do want to change it to a black and white you like the multicolored hot air balloon was that this one Okay, so I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to build my cluster on top of here. But I think what I'll do is I will just glue it to itself. Do you think that's a good idea? Maybe we'll just do that. We'll just glue it to itself. I have a baking soda tool. You like the pink one? with the journaling. Okay. So you guys like it. Okay. Cool. So as you can see, my baking soda tool does not work very well. I need to get a new one. Basically, I just move the baking soda around <laughs> and then throw the excess in the trash. Okay. There we go. Okay. So another, I'm just trying to think what I want to do with this. Okay, so let's put this down. I'm just going to put this down and we're going to go with that. Okay, we'll go with that. 
I kind of like these feathers. Those are super cute. And then I think we want to add like some flowers to this cluster. Maybe right here. I think I'm going to add the feathers down here. Um, let's see. I kind of like the idea of adding these feathers into this little It's not working very well. Oops, I lost my camera. Okay, there we go. There we go. Okay, well, I like that. I think I kind of like that. Okay, so we'll add those feathers down there. So we have a cluster here, a cluster here. Then we need, let's see, where's the sketch? I don't know what I did with my sketch. Oh, I put it over here. Then we need another cluster. It is over here. I think I'm going to move it to right here. Just so it's more of a triangle. Okay. So that's what I'm going to do. So my camera, which went under here... I think I'm going to move it up here, so maybe we'll put it under there. And then, you know, I think I'm going to do this heart. So I think the heart will be the base, and then that can just be. So since I want, you know what, I could actually start putting these down if I glue them under here. That'll be fine. Okay. Ah, I just got a different kind of glue than I normally get. It's the expensive kind of glue, the Scotch 3M glue. I never get the expensive one. I always get the cheap one. And this one is the expensive one, and I hate it. Absolutely hate it. You guys, like, seriously, I hate it so much. Okay, so let's maybe bring in that, and then, you know what, I kind of do want to add some flowers down here though, so maybe we'll just go like this. Okay. Woo! I'm so excited. Can I just think I need it? Okay. Okay. I think that's good. I like the different clusters that we have here. Any suggestions? Anybody want to shout out some suggestions? So this is the sketch that I used, and this is the layout that I made. And I'm going to do my journaling off camera real quick after I end the live, and then um, I will post a picture for you guys um, in the group and also here on the live um, in the comments once I'm all done. So what do you guys think? Also, I need help with the title. <laughs> Okay, so here are the embellishments for this month. I'm thinking, ooh, I kind of like this yellow. <gasps> Maybe I'll put this yellow one there instead of this one. Hmm. I kind of like that. There we go. And then let's see. Mm, I don't know that I really want to use any of these ones, but I do need a title. And I don't know what to do for the title. I could do growing up. Hmm, too fast, maybe, or something like that. I don't know. Middle school. 
orientation. That's so boring, though. <laughs> I'm so awful with titles. Thank you, everyone. It is such an awesome kit, isn't it, Dora? I'm kind of thinking I want to add another one of these. I'm crazy, right? My husband would be like, whoa, that's crazy. And I'd be like, I know. I am kind of a crazy person sometimes. I don't think I'm going to, though. I think they're too big, even though I love big and pretty. You know what else I could use, though? I could put another camera. Well, actually, maybe I don't like how much green that is. Mm -hmm. Brennan's big day. Oh, I like that. I changed his name. No, don't even worry about it. So many people say his name wrong. Um, and I kind of like kick our, we kind of kick ourselves now because it's like we weren't thinking about the spelling of his name because a lot of people think that he's a girl. He will get called Brianna all the time because it's spelled B-R-Y-N-N-A-N. -N -N. And so, um, yeah, we just wanted to be different. <laughs> so, yeah, none, don't even worry about it. He's been called everything under the sun. Brian, Brennan, uh, Brianna, Brianne, like, I'm like, seriously, like, you know, he's a boy. You're staring right at him. <laughs> it's kind of crazy, huh? Okay. Brennan's big J. I like that. Let's see. Brennan's big. I'm, I'm wondering if I should put something about going into middle school. Brennan's introduction to middle school. What about that? Do you like that? I just don't know where I would put it. I'm not sure that this alpha is going to stand out though, unless I put it over here, but I'm not sure it'll fit. Let's see. Let's see what, if it'll stand out. So like if I put, it's a bit long. Yeah. I don't actually mind long titles, though. Sometimes I do. Do you feel like you can see that? Like, if I do it right here? Maybe I should do Brennan's introduction to middle school. Well, I don't know. I, I don't want it to be, like, off-center. <laughs> Shooting off to middle school. Oh, I like that. Oh. They just grow so fast, don't they? I'm going to, I'll do, I like that. Shooting off to middle school. Okay, let's do that. Um, so I think I'm going to spell school first. I hope I have all of the letters. Oh, I don't know. Let's see. Okay, sometimes these are <laughs> the hardest things to pull off. Okay. School. I'm kind of wondering if I'm not going to have enough C's. Oh, I guess I only need one for middle school, right? I don't mind busy corners. Stephanie. <laughs> I don't do a lot of busy layouts, honestly. So if I do a busy layout, it's like, what is wrong with me? But honestly, I don't mind busy layouts. It's like, um, I'm kind of of the school of more is better. More is more. Is that the saying? Yeah. I think it's kind of funny because I used to, like, I should show you guys some of my old scrapbook pages. Like, yeah, I used to just put the photos on like with the, the scissors, the, uh, what are they called? The, the shape scissors, you know what I'm talking about? Like from like the nineties and the eighties. <laughs> okay. L. 
Yeah, I do agree. This corner is kind of busy, though. But I kind of feel like it's okay because I'm going to have um, the writing, and I think that that will help ground this corner. So do you think I should add more in this corner, embellishments or something? Or are you just saying that it's too busy? Which is totally fine. Okay, can you guys see that? I don't know if you guys can even see that. I mean, I bet you can probably see it now that I bring it up, right? <laughs> but can you see it from far away? I'm wondering, maybe I could outline it. I bet I could. I could probably outline it in black and that'll make it pop off. You like it? Okay. Awesome. I like doing these lives because I feel like I make, um, like, it's fun to have you guys help me <laughs> make a layout. And sometimes I will listen to you guys and sometimes I don't. Sometimes I do my own thing. Okay, let's see. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H. Where's I? Oh, this is I right here. Duh. Okay. So I think I'm going to offset middle from the word school. Okay, this is where it gets tricky. I might just have to put a sticker <laughs> in the place of the eye because I'm always afraid it's going to like fall and go somewhere. Yeah. Okay. So I think what I'll do to make them easier to see um, is outline them with a black marker. Because you're right, like even standing here, it kind of hurts my eyes to read it. Um, okay, middle. Now I need an L. Oh no, I don't have an E. I don't even have a C. Okay, let's see if we can get creative. What do you guys do when you don't... Whoops! Sorry, leaning on my table too much. Um, what do you guys do when you don't have a letter? <laughs> Use a different alpha? <laughs> okay, let's see. I think... Maybe I could use this O. I wonder if I can use this O. But if I use this O, I won't be able to do shooting. So, maybe I'm going to say going off. No, because that would be too many O's, too. Yeah! Okay. I don't know what I'm going to do. Maybe I'll deal with the title later. I guess I have an A. That I could do an E out of. Okay. Mix upper and lower case. Yeah, I could do that. Maybe I'll do shooting as uppercase, off two as um, kind of a mix of upper and lower case. Maybe that's what I'll do. Okay. Okay. Middle. Let's see. Now we just gotta make this look like an E. There we go. Did that work? I think that worked. Okay. Um let's see. Shooting off two. So O F F. Actually, you know what I'll do? I think I'll do a capital O. Duh. 
Oh, come on. Capital O for off. O, and then we'll do FF. How about here comes middle school? Oh, I like that. Here comes middle school. I do like that. Let's do that. I've never changed my title so many times before, you guys. <laughs> this is funny to me. Usually, once I pick a title, I, like, stick with it. Okay. Use a number two. Oh, that's a good idea. Because it is school. Okay. Okay. Here comes, let's do that. Here comes middle school. And I'll do here and then comes with a capital. Okay, so H or C. We're looking for a C. Here. Comes. C O. M. And then, dang it, I have the E problem again. <laughs> I forgot about that E. Um, then we'll do S. Here comes, okay, so we'll make the, oh, you know what? I have an at symbol. I wonder if that would look like an E. If I just take off. Oh, that's like really teeny tiny. If I just take off this little, the little A here comes. Okay. Ha ha! That worked out even better. Than I thought it would. Okay, I think I'm gonna move. Let's see. Here comes. Okay, there we go. Middle school. So we'll just do ease with the little, uh, what is this? Um, what's this called? Oh, I don't think that's part of the sticker. I don't know. Maybe it was. Okay. Here comes the sun. Do, 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 do. Here comes the sun. Okay, sorry guys, your comments are disappearing again. So if you're talking, I'm sorry, I can't see it. I don't know why it keeps disappearing. Okay, so let's see. We are doing some real MacGyvering tonight <laughs> with these letters. Okay. I should have just done off to middle school. That I would be done by now, but I think I'm stuck with this. Here comes middle school. This is what we're sticking with. <laughs> okay. Oh my goodness. What number of title are we on? Okay. Here. And then. C. another E and then I have to kind of make let's see and sorry you guys have been on forever today I don't think I've ever had a live that's gone over an hour 
before. Okay. I hope you're liking this. I would love to see the layouts that you're all making. And if you're, even if you're not like using the scrapbooking store kits, it's totally okay um, to post the layouts that you make with this sketch. Okay. <laughs> this is so crazy. Oh my gosh. I just, I'm just laughing. Exactly. <laughs> Be creative and work with what you've got. Here comes middle school. Okay, so now I am going to outline it so that we can all see it. And I think I might just kind of do like a basic outline. Like I'm not going to go crazy here. Oh my goodness. <laughs> yeah. I'm just gonna go around the outside. How about that? Oop. Here comes the fun. Do, 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 do. I don't know why I have that song stuck in my head now, but I do. Okay, anybody else have any suggestions? Because I think I'm finally done. <laughs> that took a while today. It is 8 o'clock my time. It's probably later for some of you. I'm so sorry <laughs> about yesterday. I always, I feel so bad, like, when I forget things like that. Like, oh my gosh, how could I have forgotten? So, yeah, I'm glad that I could make it tonight. Just barely. I think I hear my husband and the dogs upstairs. They like to kind of go crazy at night sometimes. But anyway, okay, I think I'm done. So I'm just kind of <laughs> chatting and um, not really making sense here. So I hope you guys had fun tonight. I will definitely take a photo in just a minute and post it. Um, so you guys can see the finished uh, layout with the journaling and everything. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed this live. I will see you again. Um, yeah, around the group. And I can't wait to see your layouts that you make using the sketch. But thanks so much for coming and I will see you guys again soon. Have a great night. Have fun scrapbooking and using your kit. My letters keep moving. It's kind of annoying. Come on, American Crafts. Get with the program. <laughs> Use real glue. <laughs> Thank you, Nancy. Thank you, everybody. And check out, yeah, check out my YouTube channel. There's a link. Um, my name again is Maggie. I'm also known as Crafty Maggie. You can find me on YouTube and Instagram and here on Facebook as um, Maggie Bluffin. So, and everywhere else, I'm Crafty Maggie. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you had fun. Bye!